What's good? It's your boy Sheen. Listen, Bird. We are right out. And we are jumping back into Breaking Bad. We are on season four, episode two. And the first episode set the season up so perfectly, man. Gail, the police arrived on the scene. And with that, my guy left behind his lab notes. It's about to get scary for Gus and the whole operation. We also had that boy was cooking, thought he was doing what he was doing. And that boy Gus came downstairs and had to end him. Hit him with the time to play the game. So we got a lot that's about to happen this episode. Probably they still got to, you know, set up the story a little bit. So we might get some some more information on what's going on with Walt's family. Make sure you guys click the link in the description for the Patreon. We are weeks ahead in content for everything. So you missing out on that part. And then we got uncut reactions and we got exclusives that aren't even coming to YouTube. So you're missing out on that too. So make sure you hit that link. You head over to the Patreon and you sub up. Without further ado, let's jump back into that Breaking Bad. Let's get it. So? How's it look? Meaning, do I see it? A wire? Basically, any lawman worth his salt's gonna spot that, yeah. It might be, but... 38 special. Snub nose. Got a concealed hammer, so it doesn't catch on your belt when you draw. Tried and true. Boy said tried and true. Well, I use that. If you can't get it done with five, then we're you're gonna get it. And pray, in which yeah. case, I wouldn't count on another six closing the deal. Oh, it walking around with uh, it. Old, no. it seal up real nice. If you, maybe it'll feel better on the left side. A general rule: you don't want to cross draw, not unless you're going to be sitting. Dang, that's a tip I'm taking to the book. He dead already. Either way, you're going to want to practice your draw a lot. If you're all fingers, well, it might could be him keeping the peace instead of you. Catch my drift? What's this? Well, that there is why you're going to pay me five times what you... No cereal. To state the obvious, Has I, it been used? I don't want to be caught with this on me. No, sir, to state the obvious, you don't. But I do feel the urge to ask you, are we strictly talking defense here? Yes, absolutely. If it's just personal protection, with the roof, Aside from a bucket of money, you'd save yourself a potential felony two spot for carrying a weapon with a deface serial number if you just buy it legally. Wouldn't it still be better to use one that couldn't be traced? This the West, boss. Man steps to you bent on doing you bodily harm. You got every right to plant your feet and shoot to kill. All this to say, I'm happy to take your money. I you like see him. giving him this advice and stuff though, because yeah, somebody yeah. just took that money and said, fuck it. Look at that real it's shit. For defense. This is another dumb ass decision to make. If anybody remotely close to him find that gun and see that serial number Check scratched it. off, he in some big trouble. I don't agree with this one, Cap. If you're not Mike, you don't need that. Go go to the gun store and get your your, your gun license and do all that. Blood. Blood on this boy Walt fucked up Jesse's business, Hugo's business, Saul. and Saul's business, and my man Gus. Man, skinny. That boy off the rails after he did that. Oh, that boy bad. That boy is always stuck around with Jesse. Jesse, what's up, brother? Oh, bodacious subwoofers, yo. <laughs> Serious Ooh. cannons. I like just wanna stare at him. That's what he was just in there doing. Totally makes me wanna crank old Sabbath and blaze one. That's... We're always trying to get for a... It's 120 decibels without breaking a sweat. You Hold on to your hats, bitches. He needed this though. Bro, he was sober. Look at Badger itching. Hey man, I saw Andrea at a meeting yesterday. She asked about you. Come on, Jesse, bro. And they don't even smoke no more. They don't look like it. Thanks, man, but um, 
12 steps and all that. Seriously? Yeah. Stand on it, skinny. You're respected. That's when you know you're really sober. When you say no, Badger hitting that shit. Yeah, Badger's itching for it. Maybe just a little bump. Oh, fiend. Left for dead, yo. No, 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 man. Resident Evil 4 takes it by a long shot. They talking them classics. If you're a gamer, you know. Trying to eat your brain, bro. A dude don't need no more motivation. Fair point, I guess. Okay. Now my man okay. skinny. I'm in this One of them on die. Zombie mode. Now that's the bomb, man. They got like this rage virus. Amps them up like they've been smoking the swag. Apples and oranges, bro. This is second people that Jesse got to start smoking that shit. Yeah, yeah. Shit, right? And the first time it happened, then ain't good. You know what this this place needs? You had a party. He's tweaked out. He just got the crib. He trying his best to not think about that. That shit, but that's not helping. This shit is not gonna fulfill you at all, bro. This shit gonna numb it for a little bit. I mean, you gonna have to I do something. Keep doing it. Damn, 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 damn. <laughs> What's stuck in the loop, though? That's not funny. Ah, uh, that boy Walt had him do something that he knew he couldn't do. He did it, so he could do it. Just because you did do it, don't mean you was supposed to do it. <sighs> now he would have right. He been practicing. He gonna kill Gus and then what? And he Gus. Once he blows that blue and shit back on the streets, that boy gonna get right up. He's so funny. Can you sleep? Actually, yes, Marie. This is me sleeping. What's it look like? Well, it looks like you're looking at a rock at 2.24 in the morning. This is not a rock. This is a mineral for like the 10th time. I'm just asking if maybe you Even want... Even last I counted, Marie, there are four bedrooms in this house. Yeah, he being an asshole. Yeah, he is. You know, I mean, if I'm keeping you awake and all. Yeah, Marie. Let that boy kick you away. That's what he want. Don't give it to him. He mad as shit she ain't leave. Now he about to turn off the light. Like, damn. I am drawing. She not leaving, bro. See how this boy okay. got his bullets stacked up? Where is he going to lunch, bro? Walt? Hello? Know. Walt, call me back, please. Hanks. Bills are really starting to pile up here. A second order of business. It's, uh, it's going to take the next step here. We need to look into buying this car wash. Oh, we still have. Are you screening all my calls? No, no, no. I, I'm just. What, what are you thinking? Leaving a message like that on my machine? We should not even be mentioning the words car wash on the phone at all. Period. Well, it is a car wash, not a brothel. I mean, if we can't even say what it is, why are we buying it at all? Bro, she's a fucking idiot. I am more than happy to call Goodman myself. Hey, no, 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 no. I, I. Why are you involved in what he bro, got he's going a, on he's now, bro? Getting real annoying, bro. Like to the point that I don't even want to see her on, on the screen no more, bro. It's like, bro, stop trying to make moves with my money that you didn't want me around in the first place one thing is all right yeah i'm gonna pay the bills yeah we right, agreed on about that you about to go but buy the car wash well, like, like was... you don't got no money in your pocket i gotta woke up like yo everybody get the fuck out of my crib. yeah like where everybody get these covers from what they brought them johns and they cars like yo it's a sleepover he about to break this like Hey, bro, what are you doing? Well, that shit's stinking. Man. You partied until you slept on the floor next to some random? Yeah, I'm going to work. I got bitch. Ah! Oh, come on, man. Clean up time. Let's go out and get everybody some breakfast. Stock up on liquor while you're at it. Keep this party going. Yo, that's how you wake everybody up. He's a demon. Everybody not they gonna wanna come back. Shit. Wake up and party! 
No way. That boy losing it. Can't hold it together. They got somebody new. What to say? It don't look, that didn't look like Gus. You replaced that boy Victor. Yo, you the new guy? Yeah. You got something for me? 201.6. Give it a second way, if you would, please. New policy. What, Walden? Because the way we left things, I, I would like the chance to clear the air. Walter, you're never going to see him again. Damn. Hold on, what the fuck he thought was about to happen? Go off the drugs? Oh, look who woke up hungry. Holly! Yeah, that's good. Yeah, you want to have milk? The Dodge gets a detail. You fucking annoying. Shut up. Way to go, Hank. Come on, way to Come soldier on. up. Dick! Oh, Jesus! Look at you! Where to go? Marie, stay oh out God. of it. Just ten more steps. Nine. Eight. Keep on all that pressure on that. Come on. Ah. All right, buddy. Hell's yeah! Very nice. Yeah. Why you acting like that with Marie, man? She happy for you, dog. Great session. Lots of positive energy. Lots. One day at a time. All we can do. You want to go full time? We've got a spare bedroom. Mm. I'll see you tomorrow. Did you work up an appetite? I'm sure that you did. Listen, I was thinking about cooking tonight. So Marie, I get out. No. That smile, she hurting, bro. She hurting. Why you do that to her? Damn, why you do that to Marie? Bro, she could have did that scholarship. Yo, what's up with the pie, man? It ain't cut. Yeah, right. That's the gimmick. Maybe it's like democratic, bro. You know, cut your own Christmas tree, cut your Everybody own pizza. just ripping the pizza. Yeah, it's democratic. People cut their pizza, pizza with scissors now. And Yo, yeah, come you on. Gotta figure. It might be Saul. It might be his neighbors or something. Hey, Jesse. <laughs> uh, you got um. Yeah. <gasps> oh. Party over with. Your <laughs> face. Like, yo, what the fuck going on? What, who told you to come here? She checking on him. What's that rehab every day? And then after the, the Thomas stuff, he probably hasn't came around. So, uh, how you doing? I'm dealing. Brock, honey, wait in the car, okay? Let the grown up speak. Go on, little man. We'll catch up later. Wait, was trying to pop up one of those man. Those suck. Guess he ain't seen in a minute. Gee. Guess you know I've been calling. I'm really busy at work. Jesse, I'm not here to make you come up with excuses. There's just one thing you and me got to talk about. And that's this. After Tomas was murdered, two dudes from the block, a couple bangers he used to hang with, get run over. One of them shot in the head. Same night, I get this in my mailbox. He gave her money. Damn, Jesse a good dude at heart, though. He just wanted to be cool. Whatever it is you had to do with my brother's killers, I don't want to know. But you got to tell me one thing. Is someone going to come looking for this? No. Nothing better happen to them, yo. Yeah. You'd be mad as fuck. Use it to get you and Brock out of that shithole in the neighborhood. Or you can go out and spin it on glass, and I'd have no way of stopping you. But I got to believe you won't do that. That'd be man's right there. I'm keeping that shit. I don't know how much he gave her, but that was a good amount of bread right there. Yeah, like 20 bands. Damn, he did her dirty, bro. He really liked that boy. I mean, bro, see you later, my boy. 
Stay up, G. Don't follow your fucking brother's footsteps. Or your, your, your cousin. That was his uncle. Let that boy be thinking like, oh, shit, I ain't even partying right now. That'd be my shorty. That's smart by Gus, though. I definitely want to pop out around wall. Yeah, you know what he's capable of now. That's what's crib. He probably bought an Airbnb and made that look like that was his crib. You think he really gonna let Walt come to his real crib and know where he stay at? He about to knock on the door. It's about to be a random family in there. Yeah. Eyes. <laughs> he's throwing that eyes. <laughs> oh, he's supposed to burn on the screen and shit. I don't know who Walt really think this boy. Really he he him. Somebody. He him. No, he not. He him mm -hmm. in these streets. He, he hasn't he ran up he on anybody and shot he them like he this, him. bro. He ran those two people over with the car he and couldn't move and he shot him. He him. Respect that boy name for you pop out that. You sleep standing over you, wake up to that. Polos. Go home, Walter. There's the hit. bull. The black boy. The new bull. Yeah. Like, yo, you stupid? Yo, you got Marie in there cleaning your shitter and you talking to her like that. Turn the bricks. Rocks. <laughs> she trying to do anything that make him feel better. Yes, Hank! <laughs> How many boxes? I don't know. Three, four, hundred, a million. Bro, is he putting this on Walt's tab? Delivery jag offs, I'm telling you. I'm not getting ass raped by those bastards, all right? Just, just check, please. I'm not checking shit after you told me to leave the room. But that one. This is gonna be the dumbest investment ever. Too much wax. And now she's about to walk in there? Bro, she doing too much. Nah, she OD and I ain't gonna lie. Mr. Wellenitz, my name is Skylar White. How do you do? Like, you don't even know what Walt and her, his relationship was when he was working there. You wanna buy my car wash? I do. And I am prepared to talk numbers right now, if you'd like. Get down on your hands and knees and uh, scrub like a housemaid? I know a thing or two about scrubbing. I have worked 30 years of building this business from nothing with my own hands. What are you doing so much, bro? This is not your place to do this. One which you think would adequately take- Ten million dollars. Yo, she say yes, I'm grabbing her face. Well, let's try 879,000. Where do you come up with this number? On a typical day, you average 19 cars per hour. Subtracted your overhead and salary, maintenance, operating fees, depreciation, to which I applied the industry standard multiplier and added the market value of your real estate, giving me a total estimated value of $829,000. I generously added an extra $50,000. You don't care about that. $20 million. This? this is the price for Walter White. Exactly. You don't think I know who you are? He quit without giving me notice. He broke my air fresheners. He bugged out when he left. And now he wants to buy my car wash. But he's not man enough to come in here and face me himself. Instead, he sends his woman. Excuse me? The price he pays is $20 million. Now, please leave. Like I said, you don't even know their relationship. Have you recently lost a loved one in an aviation disaster? He's crazy. This boy saw him make money on everything. So if you want to tip the scales back in your favor, better call Saul. Stop. Shit, I would have called him. This guy, Walter, and Skylar doing too much, trying. All these motherfuckers is Jesse. T. Jesse T. is off the you rails. You might want to learn how to tail better if you're planning on making it happen. Of. May I buy you a drink? Why not? You make a hell of a lot more than I do. Finish that real quick so you can give me one real quick. Yeah. Uh, another round for him, and I'll have the same noise. There were some actions that I took, which I want you to understand. Hey, what? Be quiet, bro. Oh, mm. how old did my man talk, bro? Everything I did, I did out of loyalty to my partner. I appreciate that when you were going to kill me, you were simply following orders. I get that completely. Mike, I'm trying to tell you. I get it. Drink up, Walter. I talk no juicy, don't walk on, work on my man's mic. Hell of a last couple of weeks. 
makes a man wonder exactly where he stands. I cannot be alone in feeling this way. Not after what happened to Victor. What's with the piece? Right hip inside your waistband. Now you wear it if it makes you feel better, but if push comes to shove, it's not gonna help. You and I, if it happened to Victor, it could happen to you. And what, what the hell was that anyway? Cuts a man's throat just to send a message. You won, Walter. Do yourself a favor and learn to take yes for an answer. But for how long? Ah. Get me in a room with him, and I'll do the rest. Talking about killing my boss. I should kill you right now. Oh! He deserved that. You messed up everything we had going on. Thanks for the drink. I thought they could pull those strings. He did get a new man, though. Next day. Thank my man. You're at a party, brother. Exactly what all that attention he brought to the crib when he was in the basement. He doing the same thing. I've been awake for like three straight days. Oh, God, Turning into a sleep stack. So crash here. Yeah, that's cool and all, but I think I got like this cat. I think I'm like supposed to feed it. That shit dead. You sticking or do I gotta flip you over and check you for a sliz? Bro, I'm kind of pushing flowers here, yo. Hell, brother, you know we got mad love for you. He don't want to be alone. I was thinking like next week. Yeah, sure, man. Next week. We cool? We are cool. There's shit all over the wall in there. Like, now he got sitting there smell like and clean that. What I'd give him something to do. Three straight days is crazy. Everybody's sitting right in front of that speaker. He officially like face to face killed somebody that didn't deserve it. And he knew he didn't. Can't say he's a good dude because he's selling that shit. But I mean, he was a good dude, bro. He was just like how Walt was when he first started, not doing shit but cooking. All right, yeah, that was the end of episode two of season four. It's a lot of people doing too much, and it's about to be a lot of problems going on within the organization or in Walt's life and Jesse's life and Skylar's life and Mike's life. Jesse, I don't know how long he's going to be able to take this. He need to vent to somebody. I believe it's going to be on and Andrea. I believe it's going to be her that he's going to vent to about what he did. Because I think that's the only person he can truly talk to. At this point, he's walking up on Gus's house at night. Hey bro, come on. You thought you thought you were just gonna walk up to his crib and knock knock on his door? Boy parked right in front of his crib. Rolled up with the lights off. Like, bro, come on. You're not incognito. I know Gus is probably gonna take some measures into his own hands and show Walt that you're not just messing. You're not messing with the small dogs no more, man. It's a big dog that you truly trying to mess with, and I can get you touched at any moment. Like that boy Tyler called, like, yo, go home. But, um, Tyson, boy. Tyson. 50 Tyson. Skylar walking into the car wash thinking that she just gonna be able to shout out some numbers and the guy is going to just give up the car, the car wash. So now with that, that can even go on file with a uh, buy a business for 879,000 and people already know, like, where they work. Basically, what I'm saying is that. If the feds wanted to trace back and see if any funny business is going on, they could do that by just tracking how much they make in a year, her and Walt, and seeing that they have nowhere near the funds to buy that car wash. So I got a feeling that by like episode five, it's gonna be a lot of stuff going on. I just don't like how Skylar's kind of making these decisions without Walt's approval and nudging her way into the situation. Respectfully though, because of the whole situation when Hank was Walt's fault, but she got Walt already taking care of his bills and then she want him. All right, so let me put it in this perspective. His bills is probably like, it gotta be up to like a hundred thousand easy right now. Well, with we... all that stuff, like total. Oh yeah. With all the stuff that he has in his house and like it's been probably three weeks that they haven't paid the bill. So let's, let's say, let's say like a hundred thousand right there. 
and then she's trying to offer eight hundred seventy nine thousand. Like, who's to say that he has that much money? Like, what if he said he was had seven figures? What if he had a million dollars on a dot? Yeah. And well, she basically you try to take nine hundred seventy nine thousand of that and try to make your own moves with it. Like, come on, bro. And then if you use that nine hundred seventy nine thousand, he only has a million dollars. How is he about to pay next week for Hank shit? Like, how is he going to take care of y'all bills? You feel me? Like, you making all these moves and trying to set stuff in stone without talking to him. You don't even want him in the crib. You didn't want to be with him. And like, you just like, bro, uh, you basically putting out almost a million dollars of his money without talking to him about it is crazy, bro. Like just two, three weeks ago, you didn't want nothing to do with the bull. Like you just asked for the divorce. He signed the papers. You didn't hand the papers in. And then now you want to be extra involved in everything. So that's the only issue I got with everything. Like she's making, she's doing it like it's her money. Like at the end of the day, he worked for that money for the family. It's not your money to be making these decisions with. Like if he was like, yo Walt, like I think we should move or we need help with the bills, then like, by all means, like demand that money because like, you know what's going on now, but trying to buy the car wash and do all this extra shit, like, bro, that's not your place to be doing that. But so. not for that whole situation. Uh, we ain't really see my man saw this episode at all. So he probably still paranoid. My man, Mike, shout out to Mike, bro. I appreciate you for doing that to that man while he do need his ass beat because he getting a little too crazy. He making ra irrational moves without thinking like head. what's the next step and that's the same thing that happened with the whole jesse situation with um gail it's like what's the next step after that you feel me like you kill gus what's next you feel me like you don't think there's no repercussions that's gonna come from that mike could have just killed him there for even playing with gus name like that like he's my boss i've been working with, with him for this long like who's who who are you to like you already got my man victor killed you know what i'm saying so it's like you put us in a bad situation you kill gail so it's like situation. why like why do you keep taking these measures to like one up what you just did or what you just had done and then jesse he going through a lot right now um so it's just sad that that whole situation is going on with him right now and like he doesn't have nobody to talk to about it or just be around Good episode, man. If you enjoyed that reaction, make sure you like the video, comment down below, let us know your thoughts on the subscribe button, the bell icon, so you know if I enjoyed these videos. We appreciate y'all. Thank y'all for all the love and support. We're officially, as of May 30th, one whole season ahead from you guys, and we're going to be doing doubles a week. So um, we'll be basically halfway through season five by the time you get this episode. So um, we appreciate y'all. Thank y'all for the love and support, man. By the time we get this, we should be at like uh, almost 12,000 inching our way there so thank y'all for all the love man but until the next video the kids reacted